All right, we've been keeping an eye on the radar all day long. We've been having some of those summertime pop up storms here or there, and as expected, not everybody has seen rain today, but the folks that have seen rain have seen a lot of it. We've got some heavy rain right now moving through the Memphis metro area. A couple of showers down near Tunica as well, but uh, this shower in Memphis downpour really it's quick moving, but it is packing a punch as it rolls through coming over Poplar and Highland right now. Midtown Cooper Young area getting in on some of that heavy rain and this is all moving to the north. So if you're in, uh, you know, up toward Bartlett and Raleigh, even Frazier, you are also going to be seeing some of that heavy rain. Maybe some thunder here in the next little bit as well. Now another spot that saw some thunder today was Mississippi State and Starkville as they took on the Memphis Tigers. That game really just getting started again after a two and a half hour weather delay. The lightning moving out, but hey, those storms did provide for some great clouds, some colors in the sky. This photo from Carter Bentley on Twitter. You see all the colors as that storm set up just to the south of Davis Wade Stadium. Tonight we've got the chance for some showers in here until midnight, so don't put the rain gear away just yet. Have an indoor backup plan if you are outside because we could have a couple more downpours here for the next couple of hours. But in general, after that, I think most of the night is going to be dry. Tomorrow morning, we wake up to cloud cover, muggy conditions, temperatures in the 70s. And just like today, the best chance of rain is going to be in the afternoon between about noon and 6 p.m. And you're going to find that's really going to be the trend for the next six or seven days. Here's the next 24 hours again tonight. A couple of showers continuing. Those should be gone by tomorrow morning and by the time you wake up, we'll have mostly cloudy skies. Check out 11 AM though already some storms trying to pop up and we'll see those storms grow into the afternoon. Again, not everybody sees rain tomorrow, much like today, but there will be some heavy downpours around, especially tomorrow east of the Mississippi River in Western Tennessee and Northern Mississippi. Just like today, by sunset, the storms start to fall apart, and by this time tomorrow, any rain that's left uh, should be pretty much done. So a 40% chance of rain tomorrow. Labor Day, actually the lowest rain chance of the week, still a 30% chance. Could see some storms, but the rain chances start to go back up again by Tuesday. So basically, spotty storms possible every day this week, especially between noon and 6 p.m. Labor Day, storms possible, not a washout, but rain chances go back up for the end of the weekend. Unfortunately, it looks like even into next weekend, the Southern Heritage Classic, that could feature some showers and storms as well.